MyQuest staff and faculty, uh, we know you've received emails about our COVID-19 measures, but we thought it might be helpful if we filmed a little video um, to explain to you some of the measures that we have in place. Um, and so we are still in phase one, which means that only essential staff uh, should be on campus. If you have a question about whether or not this is you, you simply contact your supervisor. If you are coming to campus, we ask that you notify human resources. This is so that we can manage our resources and custodial services appropriately. Um, we're gonna give you a little insight into the measures here in the library building. So you'll see there's two signs posted on the door. One is just a reminder about physical distancing. We do ask that you keep that two meters. The other is a reminder to not to enter if you're sick or having symptoms. Uh, we do require all staff coming to campus to self-monitor for symptoms and not to come to campus um, if they have any illness or COVID-19 related symptoms. If you have been to campus and you do experience symptoms, please complete that online form shared with you by Human Resources. It was the same form that we used in the spring for declarations as well. Um, we are going to be entering into a common space, so we do ask that you wear masks in common spaces, especially when physical distancing um, is not possible. So I'm just going to put this on and we'll head inside. There is a film crew here right now, so reception looks a little bit different. Um, but you will notice that there's cordon off barriers, both at reception and security, to ensure um, that six feet or two meter distance. So please respect that when you're using the common spaces. Please wear a mask. Also, if you have to pick up mail, please stay two meters from the reception desk. Operations will be sending um, mail to the academic building. Uh, for those who are working in that space, so you can check your mail slots there. But if you do have to come to front reception, again, please wear a mask, keep that distance, and sanitize your hands. If you are working in the academic building, please enter the building through this bottom garage um, stairwell, and then head up to the top floor via the elevator. Um, this just reduces the number of entrance and exit points and pathways within the building, um, so it allows us to focus our custodial services on these specific traveled areas. When traveling in the elevator, please limit capacity to two people max or one household. Also, just a reminder, please don't use the stairwells unless it's an emergency. Um, this helps us uh, limit uh, where custodial services has to tend to. There are hand sanitizer stations all around campus, so please sanitize your hands if you're not able to wash them with soap and water, um, especially before and after entering common areas. For the washrooms in the academic building, please use the washrooms on the top floor, again, to reduce the demand on custodial services. We have a recommended occupancy of two people, um, so please just be mindful of that. Um, and wait for occupants to depart before entering. In the faculty lounge, please note maximum, maximum occupancy of four. Please do wear a mask as it's a common space. Stay six feet apart. Also, while custodial services will tend to the space, there's also disinfecting wipes available. So please wipe down any high touch surfaces after you use them. 